In the year 1740, a German naturalist named Georg Wilhelm Steller went on an expedition to Kayak Island off of Alaska from the Kamchatka Peninsula in eastern Russia with the Danish explorer Vitus Johansson Bering. During the trip, he encountered and recorded many unidentified species of plants and animals, which many are named after him. One of these creatures was a large Cyrenian, known as the Sea Cow. Its closest living relative is the Dugong, although it was much larger, growing up to a length of 9 meters with an estimated weight of 10 tons. It was adapted for cold climates with a 2.5 centimeter thick layer of outer skin and a 10 centimeter thick layer of blubber. It also had a whale-like tail similar to that of the closely related dugong. For food, they ate kelp and sea grasses that grew in shallow coastal waters. Unlike other Cyrenians, the sea cow was positively buoyant and was restricted to remain near the surface of the water. Their habitat was around the Commander Islands and the Aleutian Islands in the Bering Sea, although fossil evidence provides a wider range, including the coasts of Japan and North America. The route that had been explored by Bering and Steller was then used by fur traders, seal hunters, and explorers who often hunted the sea cow to restock their food supplies. The natives in the area also hunted them and used their skin to make boats. In 1768, only 27 years after its recorded discovery by Europeans, the sea cow was declared extinct. It is believed that their population was already endangered at the time of its discovery. Even after its extinction, there have been many reported sightings of the sea cow into the 1800s and even into the present day. The last four living species of Cyrenian may go extinct as well without human intervention as their populations remain threatened.